Hey, <clears throat> we're up here at the Trey Mountain Shelter, about uh, 4,000 feet above sea level, a little more than that actually, I think it might be closer to 4,300. That's pretty chilly up here. You got some nice carnation instant breakfast, um, substituting as hot cocoa tonight. Mm -hmm. Added some uh, nice powdered milk, that's one of our favorite treats out here. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so anyway, we started out today not really knowing um, how how the knees were going to be doing with with my wife here, but uh, we we hiked up here and didn't have any major issues. We we used these big Frankenstein uh, <laughs> like hinged. Uh, braces on on both knees on both of her knees and uh, here's what this shelter looks like it's kind of it's kind of cool a little bit cozy we set up camp here home sweet home this is the first time that we've spent a night in a shelter we came up here and it was deserted so we're like oh we're gonna try this out instead of our tent mm -hmm. so kind of fun Anyway, every day that we're out here trying to be obedient to God and sharing His Word, we we see Him confirm, um, and just and there's just there's fruit uh, to that, and we're we're so thankful for that because if we were out here and we felt like we weren't getting anywhere, obedience should be enough. But God knows that we're human and and we like to see people respond. The other day in Wendy's, I was with Ralph, and and he shared the the gospel with a boy at the at the counter. And uh, hopefully, you know, we'll see him in heaven someday. We he seemed very sincere. And uh, up and down the trail today, we shared with a couple people. Um, it was kind of nice. A guy from India who was super friendly actually gave us his um, granola bar kind bar. It was really nice of him. And we met a couple other hikers hiking. Um, and one of them was from Ukraine. Not Ukraine, but somewhere. He sounded Ukrainian. We're not sure where he was from, but he, uh, you know, when we shared with him, handed him a card, told him what our mission was and everything. He's like, he nudged his friend. He's like, see, I told you. And I, I don't know what what that was all about exactly but he said you know boy i wish we had a hundred sandwiches we could hand out here to hikers he seemed to have a real good heart for people so that blessed us and we met another guy named salmon tell us about salmon well we'll have a post of about him but he was uh pretty nice he came just hiking down the trail for all he was worth and trying to transfer the the bowl here anyway uh he he was had a super big personality and uh took time to just chat with us a bit and super cheerful and mm -hmm. just what you like to see and hear when you're having a, a hard time getting back into the hiking life <laughs> uh, yeah after a few days of vegetating a little bit <laughs> <clears throat> but yeah, we um, anyway, have a good night and uh, God bless you. We're going to be down to about 40 degrees up here on the mountain tonight, so we're, we're hoping our sleeping bags and our liners and our extra layers are going to keep us nice and toasty. Mm -hmm. So, love you.